Hey, Mike. Hey, what's up, man? Dog may hit the camera, but let's see what happens. Find out. This box comes courtesy of my buddy Larry. Uh, I was down there a few weeks ago, and um, he had some beer for me. I had some beer that I bought, I believe. I don't remember what's. I remember a couple things in this box. I don't remember everything that's in this box, but we're gonna we're gonna dive into it. I just want to take everything out, then we'll go through it all. Yeah. Oop. Uh, well, let's go with the one that's that's unwrapped. We'll do that one first, but we'll just. Oh yes. This year's version of bourbon barrel aged sexual chocolate. So it's Foothills. It's there's a bourbon barrel aged imperial stout that Mike and I love. We've done reviews of. Although we have some cans that we've never done during my fridge. Yeah, we have cans in this fridge, too. Uh, I actually had one the other day, a bourbon barrel one from like a year or so ago. It was pretty good. Oh, jeez. Oh, Jesus Christ. How much beer is in here? Yeah, Fuck, Sean. Oh, I remember these beers now. Yeah, I, I definitely bought these when I was down there. I forgot about that. <laughs> oh, Christ. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, dude. Is that it? Yeah. All right. So I guess let's start with the cans that are open. Um, here, take that one. Sure. So this one is Forgotten Roads. I went to the brewery when when I was there. They, they had a new spot in Greensboro. This is um, Call Sign Eclipse Eagle. It's an IPA with Eclipse and CTZ hops. And I remember, I like, it takes a lot for me to get an IPA nowadays and buy it. This blew me away. So hopefully, it, the, hopefully in the can it blows me away. <laughs> it's from um, their uh, veterans. Yeah. Clearly with the... Cool. All right, so the one I have here is Beer of Fortune, Belgian Chapelle from Deep River Brewing. Let the beer do the thinking. Lahyism? I don't know. So, uh, yeah, it's a Belgian Chapelle, which I'm way into, so uh, I wonder if they're going to get in trouble for this IP. Oh, yeah, because the Wheel of Fortune people know who Deep River Brewing is. <laughs> Dude, who did... Uh, who did Coors go after or something? Or remember Stone. Th- yeah. No, no, Stone went after Co- Stone went after Coors. Oh, that's what it was. Yeah, yeah. Which was- <laughs> My bad. <laughs> I forgot. Uh oh. Oh motherfucker! <laughs> oh no! Oh no! This is awesome. This is a querido y perdido imperial stout, uh, beer brewed with cinnamon, cocoa nibs, vanilla, and chilies. I like that. We are dedicated to those we have loved and lost and ones who have survived for whom life will never be the same. A portion of the proceeds from the sale of this beer will be donated to Breast Cancer Research Foundation. This beer is fabulous. It's amazing. Uh, this is another Forgotten Roads. I picked this up when I was there. Um, Pine Street Porter, 5.6%. It's just a, a, a no-bullshit porter. It was really, really good. Uh, this one here is from Hopfly Brewing. Uh... I don't know what the name of it is, but it's a jalapeno saison. Ooh. This doesn't look like there's a name. But that's interesting. Uh, you know I like jalapeno, but you also know I don't like chilies in my beers. <laughs> What's that? Tell me more, tell me more. Why don't you take Ooh. it? Oh. More Forgotten Road Ales. This is a uh, Eclipse Eagle. Oh, same one. Yeah, same one. Okay. Oh, here's one of the here's here's what I knew was in here, and I guess I I, I knew the forgotten roads were in there, but I forgot about them. So this is the wild turkey, the wild turkey variant of not variant, uh, wild turkey single barrel Easter egg version of of this year's Bourbon County. Oh yeah, and this is that. forgotten road ales, barley wine style ale, batch three bourbon barrel aged. It's called February Drill, and in an eight ounce can. Hell yeah! So. These 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 cans are just the best thing ever. Whoa, what's this? Searching for proof that we've truly lived. Wine barrel aged farmhouse saison brewed with pears, honey, and locally grown green Szechuan. Uh, oh, this is also for. Oh, right, Larry got the me peppercorns. Yeah, Larry got me this one. This is forgotten road ales too. But he yeah, before I went down. Like what? The perf- this bottle is adorable. <laughs> you look. Jesus. <laughs> yeah, that's awesome. Oh, more sex with chocolate. Hooray! Yeah, definitely hooray. Is that a bourbon barrel aged one or the regular one? Bourbon barrel aged okay, imperial cool. stout. All right, one of these ones. 
these the same as? One of them looks the same. Yeah. Let's see. February drill. Mm, this is February drill, but this is February drill with espresso, vanilla, and coconut. That sounds horrible. The, if I didn't say espresso, you'd be like, oh, that espresso sounds great. Espresso. That sounds great. It's horrible. Uh oh, we have the dog. Let's see what happens. And this is their coconut and vanilla rye with espresso. Rye stout aged in bourbon barrels with, with yeah, espresso and coconut and vanilla. Sounds awful, Sean. <sighs> well, maybe the other adjuncts will. Um... This is uh, Bourbon County brand stout uh, 2022. And this is uh, Willet. Willet. So now I think we have the whole set. I think there was only three. So Willet, Wild Turkey, and then I have a Heaven Hills in there from, from Kyle. The Willet is courtesy of Larry, and the Wild Turkey is courtesy of Achi. I had to see both to know what it was. This I picked up the right before we went to the airport. We went to a, um, a bottle shop, and they had a bunch of Trillium, which is kind of weird, <laughs> and, and Hop Butcher. Interesting. <laughs> And they had this Fremont's Babom. Like I guess Fremont's Babom is like a, supposed to be like a upper echelon hmm. barrel aged imperial stout. Uh, but this one is imperial. So this oh, it's not a winter. It's not a stout. Sorry, it's an imperial winter ale aged in bourbon barrels. This this year's release of Babom is aged in eight to twelve year old American oak bourbon barrels and is a blend of nine, twelve, and twenty four month old bourbon barrel aged winter ale, distinct oak cacao leather toffee and dark coffee notes from the extended barrel aging. Wow. Ridiculous. Please do enjoy this unique barrel ale today, but know that B-Bomb will be will age grace, gracefully for at least another five years. Don't be afraid to be abominable. Wow. <sighs> Which one here are you most excited about? I would say... I don't know. It's so hard. There's so many... <laughs> it's, yeah, this, one's, this is pretty bonkers. Like, I was excited about both bourbon counties, but like... I mean, come on. The Is barley it? wine, I didn't... Because they didn't have it on tap, so I didn't try the barley wine from Forgotten Roads. Um, I'm always excited to try sexual chocolate. 100%. Uh, this, uh, maybe the latest batch of Quirido de Piedro. Uh, Quirido de y Perdido. Yeah, what, what Mike said. Yeah, um, this is always, always a highlight whenever we get to try this. Uh, what do you want? <laughs> I think that's the note of when he's like, uh, you guys need to stop these reviews and pay attention to me. Oh, Jesus Christ. Good girl. Uh, uh, th you know which one I'm ex most excited about is probably the regular uh, February drill. Yeah, yeah. I'd say we could we could probably do that next week or something like that or let it sit out. Maybe we could... What, what's the EBV on it? 12,000, uh, I think. It's yeah. A it's yeah, it's close to 1,000%. But yeah, no, you're right. Yeah, that's... Oh, wait, the Belgian Trapel, though, too. Yeah, that's true. Yep. There's so many. And yeah. Yeah. yeah, the, the uh, yeah, what do you call it? Uh, Dynasty, what's the name of the Deep River. Deep River. That sounded, that was one of the first ones we op opened. That sounds awesome. Yeah. Everything in here sounds amazing. So, Facts. Larry, dude, thank you for sending this. The The beers that, that you threw in here are freaking awesome. I think I remembered the ones that I threw in here myself, but either way, dude, you're awesome. Um, down in the comments, which ones do you want to see us review first, second, last, or which ones do you want to see us review the most? Be on the lookout for some type of vertical, not vertical, some type of Bourbon County review where we probably go through all of them, but there's no way we're going to do all three in the same day. Yeah. Unless we want to get stupid, which... Well, we, if we... we yeah, but not going to happen. Wouldn't make sense. Um, but yeah, nerdsense.net, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, those are your things. Like, comment, subscribe, those notification bells so you can find me posting videos. And I'm Sean. I'm Mike. And this, this is, is NerdSense. Nerd